Hey guys, Grant with Nick's Handmade Boots, and today we're gonna to be talking about our new 360 to, wait, 360 or 365 degree stitch down? 365 degree stitch down. We call it the 365 degree stitch down because it's a little bit of a play on words. It's 360 degrees, but the 365 signifies that our boots are made to be worn every day for all occasions. The 365 degree stitch down construction was really inspired by our customers. Our customers were wanting something that was a bit more water resistant, a bit more flexible, and something that allowed them to put an insole into the boot, whether that was a veg tan, hard, thick insole, or something a little bit more cushiony. Our 365 degree stitch down construction is taking most of the leather out of the inside of the boot. Rather than building the boot around a veg tan insole, we're building it around rubber. This rubber is the exact same rubber that is in all of our other boots. It's the rubber that we use on the slip sole of all of our lug sole boots. The idea here is that we want to take the things out of the boot that water does not like. And water doesn't love veg tan leather. It can start to crack, it can start to get brittle, but water doesn't mind rubber. So that's why the base of this boot is built around rubber versus leather. Secondarily, and probably just as important, is that the stitching goes all the way around the boot, even the heel counter area. As you know, we are known for our stitch down construction. We're taking the vamp, we're flaring it out, and we're stitching it into the midsole or the outsole. On this construction, we're also doing the same thing with the heel. This prevents any type of water or moisture from penetrating into the boot. So let's talk about the importance of sealing the exterior of the boot from the elements. As you can see on our stitch down constructions that are 270 degrees stitch down, we do not stitch down the heel area. That is because this leather is folded under, glued, nailed, and tacked to the insole. Even if you get debris in here, you're not, it's not gonna penetrate its way into the interior of the boot. Moisture, however, a lot of moisture, I'm talking standing in water for long periods of your day, that will start to seep into the boot, into the leather layers, into the nails, and you will start to see a bit of rust and rot in the boot over time. The reason the 270 degree stitch down boots are not inferior and have worked forever is because that heel height. Very rarely is somebody in water above the midsole allowing water to penetrate in just above the midsole and under the boot. But again, there are a lot of you that are waiting in water. If you're utility workers, if your job requires you to be standing in water for hours at a time and that water level is up above the midsole, again, this may be something to consider. But if you're not standing in, in deep water for hours a day, there's really no added benefit to stitching down the heel counter. Also, if you've ever been on our website and you've looked at our boots and you've just thought they're beautiful, the craftsmanship's amazing, but I would just never buy one of those because they're too bulky, clunky, thick, beefy, you may hop on over to the 365 degree page because these boots may appeal to you. You might be thinking, oh no, this is Nyx's road down to cheap, low-priced boots. The fact of the matter is, these boots are actually a bit more work, rubber is a little bit more expensive than leather, and just as much work and craftsmanship goes into these boots as these boots. We are committed to building the highest quality boots. We don't have a good, better, best business model here. Everything that we put on our website is our highest quality workmanship and our highest quality product. I don't buy it. A real boot is made using a whalebone as a needle 
and my beard hair for the thread. Really, a whalebone? Beard hair, give me a break. So some of you are like, I need, I want my boots built the most classic way ever. I don't want any of this fancy new technology like 365 stitch down. I want it done the old way. Well, there's pros and cons to doing it the old way. Here's a tore down boot that was hand sewn. That's where a boot maker takes a needle and an awl and a thread and they go all the way through the insole. And you can see on teardown, this thing is packed with dirt because all of those holes from the hand sewing have allowed ash, dirt, moisture, and debris to go right into the insole of the boot. And as you can see, this thing is hammered. The actual insole of the boot, believe it or not, you know, that is veg tan leather. It looks like some kind of, I don't know. But this is what happens when veg tan gets exposed to sweat, water, moisture, and the elements. And when the boot is built around this foundation and this happens, even though the exterior of the boot might look fine, the boot has to be completely rebuilt. The beauty of the 365 degree stitch down is again, it's built on a rubber base. You can drop that veg tan insole right in. And when this thing gets cracked and worn, you take it out, you throw it away, and you buy a new one on our website. If you don't like the feel of kind of the stiffer tooling leather veg tan, we also sell all kinds of leather insoles on our website. This is the actual boot leather. This is 1964. We cut it out in the shape of an insole. It goes right into the boot. This has a little bit more water resistance because it's got some oil on it and it's a little bit softer. So we give you the options. Whatever insole you wanna put in there, you can put in there. No matter what boot you're buying on our website, you are getting the best boot that we make. The 365 stitch down boots, although they've got some added rubber inside, they're still utilizing our thick veg tan heel counters. That thing is stiff. And also our veg tan leather shank, which still gives you that moldability in the shank area versus a fiberglass or steel shank. So let's recap. Is the NYX stitch down construction inferior? Absolutely not. If you have an open order for Urban Loggers, Hot Shots, Builder Pros, Urban Drifters, keep that order open. You will be experiencing the classic build of a NYX handmade boot. If you need something that's a little bit lighter weight, if you're wading in water, you may consider transitioning to the 365 degree stitch down boots, which you can find at the link below. You'll find the tactical boot, the waterwork boot, the hiker, and this month, you'll see some other boot models on there as well. Hey guys, again, thanks so much for watching. This is our third video on our new NYX USA channel. We want to know what you think. We want to know what you want to see on this channel. Go ahead and put it in the comments below. We're also going to link all of our new 360 to 5 degree stitch down boots in the description below. Thanks for watching. Hey Grant, what's your favorite boot model? Whale bones and beard hair. Grant, you excited about the sunny weather? Whale bone and beard thread.